Hello everyone, welcome back to my capital life. This is a bit of a different setup. Um, I am hoping I don't have to do this video multiple times. I am in office. I am off work, but I am in office. We have an event tonight at um, my university that I am staying around for because I am supporting my um, Soul Wars uh, <laughs> members. Soul Wars, for those of you who don't know, are um, members of my sorority. My sorority is Sigma Gamma Rose Sorority Incorporated. If you've been around for a long time for the old, old videos, you know, you know my sorority. Uh, I'm staying around for coordination to support them because they're participating in that. Whew. I feel like I was talking really fast there, so I wanted to get it out of the way. This video is going to be um, about um, my conversion and um, how I'm feeling. So if you are interested in that, please give this video a thumbs up, please share it, and keep watching. Okay, so yesterday, let me, let me go back. It is official, I am a Jewish woman now, which is a lot <laughs> for me to say, and this setup is different, so it's a little weird. Um, <laughs> talking to this setup right now and being at work doing this video but I did not want to um wait yesterday was a lot it was a lot of um things in my mind a lot of emotions it was just a lot I was going through yesterday so I didn't turn on the camera I just wanted to be in those moments and um take in um, those feelings. And um, I will say the a lot of the feelings I felt were um, love and affirmation and um, joy and peace. Uh, a, a great deal of peace. And so to start um, the love, um, people showed up for me that I didn't know were going to show up for me. I invited, um, my family and, um, let me rephrase. I invited my children. I invited my partner and, um, I didn't make a big deal of inviting them because this journey in my mind has been very, um, personal journey. I've been going through this journey, but what I realized is I am not the only one that has been going through this journey. I am the one going through the conversion and the commitment, but my direct family, my children, my um, partner, my best friend, my rabbi, rabbis with an S on it, teachers, they have been going through the journey with me as well. And that is what I realized yesterday. That's where the um, love and the peace came in because um, they showed up. And um, not only did they show up, they showed up and spoke about how um, proud they were of me and how um, I have gone through this. And even in the dips and curves and things throughout this journey, I've maintained my um, steadfastness, I guess you can call it, or I kept my eye straightforward. Um, and the journey has been, now that I think about it, the journey hasn't been that long. But honestly speaking, the journey has been long. This journey honestly started four years ago. Um, the recent journey with this particular rabbi is only a year old. But this journey and this transition literally started uh, just about four years ago. So they have been with me, specifically my children and my best friend have been with me as I did this and transitioned and learned and grew and took on the mitzvot and the things of that 
nature. They have been with me, walking through this with me and taking them on in their way also. And then um, the same thing with my partner has been watching and learning and um, caring. Also, even though this is very, very new, it, it just, it was an amazing moment. Um, even sitting in front of the Bay Dane was, it was um, a moment. It was really an amazing moment. Um, I didn't find the questions and the comments difficult. I didn't have a difficult time answering them. I didn't um, second guess myself. Uh, I just moved forward. And um, what I got back from them, the acknowledgement, the um, encouragement from my particular rabbi, um, yeah. It was a beautiful experience. And now that I've transitioned and I am no longer going through the conversion process, I am now living my life as a Jewish woman. It's, it is a new journey um, <laughs> and a continuation. And so it, I just, I, just wanted to be in those moments and not think about videos and things like that. Now, I did post a short, you know, YouTube shorts. My best friend captured that moment. Um, and we have a couple of pictures. Um, and I probably put them probably at the end or something, or at the end probably. But it wasn't a lot of camera camera time. It was just being in the moment time and um, talking and feeling all the feelings. <laughs> yeah, so I'm sorry. That is, it is simply a wonderful moment and I'm so happy to say that I am a part of the tribe now. I am a, a Jew Jewish woman and um, I have on my um star david magna david yes i have it on this is my first one and i'm so proud to wear it um this will probably not be my last one because it's a little small but um i waited until after i got out the mikvah um and they um everybody congratulated me and sang and it was just it was wonderful. And I got to hold um, the tour for the first time as a Jewish woman and um, received the blessings as I was holding the tour. And um, it, was, it, it was just beautiful. It was um, beautiful. And I can't wait to continue my journey of learning and living <coughs> and growing in the community and um, growing in my faith and growing and um, allowing Hashem to lead us and uh, <laughs> growing my family. Not, not, no plans to have more children, but um, um, raising or continuing to raise my youngest daughter and showing my family and sharing my, who I am. Um, is is as you can see I'm kind of um, struck for words so my name <laughs> so as I said um, previous I think I said it in a previous video I already knew what my name was um, but I wanted to not say it yet so um, I will share it now I am um, Naomi Bach Francis so Naomi is the Jewish name that um, was chosen um, that really connects with me. Naomi, mother-in-law Ruth. Uh, if you know that story, Ruth is um, 
hailed as the first convert. Um, so Naomi was her mother-in-law. If you know the story, um, I really connected with that name because of Naomi's um, perseverance and her um, commitment to see her daughter-in-laws, both of them actually, do better and have better and um, commitment to her family. So, yeah. And my second name is, um, the name is in English is Naomi's daughter of Francis. And Francis is actually my mom's name. So I honored my mom. I did not choose, um, it's normally, uh, a lot of converts will choose Sarah or Abraham. And um, I chose to continue to honor my mom um, who raised me as a single parent and um, loved my mom. So when my rabbi and I were discussing it, he was like, because of, you know, you're a convert, you can choose your name and you can decide because um, if I was born Jewish, it would have been whatever my mom's name was, uh, my Jewish mother's name. And even though my mom is not Jewish, I can still use her name. So Naomi by Francis. That's me. That's who I am. <laughs> and uh, it, it's, it's beautiful and it's um, wonderful. And it's very um, interesting. I will tell this one story years ago um, years ago, maybe one, one or two, <clears throat> this might've been a video, one, one of the first videos that I did on this channel, I did my, um, African DNA and my African DNA came back to, um, I am Cameroonian, um, from the Bamalike, Bamalike tribe on my maternal side. And, um, I went through a naming ceremony. The Cameroonian um, delegates were coming to the United States. They were doing, um, uh, there was an event going on where we were honoring the first slave ship that landed in the United States. Excuse me, y'all. I have a, still have a little bit of a sinus situation going on. And they were doing a naming ceremony and it was really, it, it all kind of lined up because I found out I was Cameroonian and um, on my maternal side and they were offering the naming ceremony. So I had to complete a whole form and everything. <coughs> and I, a name was chosen for me. They prayed and all of that stuff. And a name was chosen for me. And the name that was chosen way back then was Nomi. And Nomi is their version of Naomi. And I had forgot about that um, years and years and years ago. So when it came to now, when choosing a name, that wasn't like in my head at all. I totally forgot about it, but we had started discussing the name and I, and my rabbi was like, think about it, really think about it and pray and what connects to you. And, you know, I looked and I Googled what most converts pick and things like that. And Ruth kept coming up, but Ruth didn't connect to me. So I didn't want to pick Ruth because it didn't connect to me. But Naomi, she connected to me, her her character, who she was. Um, we have a lot of similarities in our character. And um, that is the name that connected to me. So when my rabbi and I talked about it, um, I talked about how she connected to me, why I felt like this was my name. And my rabbi was like, I really do agree with you. This name does does make sense for you. And that's how my rabbi and I kind of chose this name. And then it came back to my memory. And I was like, man, the, the name kind of sounds familiar. And I had to look it up. And it, it is actually the same name. <laughs> so... It all aligns, it all works out, who knew? But yeah, so I just wanted to share because I said I was going to share and I wanted to, I didn't want to wait so long to share because I wanted to do it while I was still fresh in my memory. 
if you have any specific questions about um, going before the Beydin or going into the mikveh, please ask them down in the chat. I don't mind doing another video and answering as many specific questions as I can. This was kind of an overview. <coughs> Excuse me. This was very much an overview and this was more of not the logistics of it, but the feelings and the emotions and my thoughts about everything that I, um, not everything, but what I felt and what I went through. So if you want more logistic and things of that nature, go ahead and drop a line down in the chat. Please like, share, subscribe, and um, I will see you again really, really soon. And um, we might be doing a channel name change. This might be, next time it might be, welcome to my capital Jewish life. I don't know. How does that sound? Welcome to my capital Jewish life. I am Naomi. Great to see you here. <laughs> but we'll see you next time. All right. Bye.